happy morning students welcome all today in science we are going to learn about organs for breathing in animals from lesson 6 animals habitat and adaptations children in last session we learnt about adaptations of body coverings let's do a quick recall any change in the features or behaviors of an animal that helps it to survive in its habitat is called adaptation animals have features or adaptations suited to the habitat they live in an animal's body covering helps it to live in a particular habitat let's recall the adaptations of body coverings in animals they are scales fish snakes crocodiles and lizards have bodies covered with scales scales prevent the loss of water from their bodies provides protection from harsh climate or protect against predators shell snails turtles have shells to protect their soft and delicate bodies next feathers birds have bodies covered with feathers that help them fly feathers also help to keep them warm hair and fur sheep and bears have hair and fur on their body to keep themselves warm next is camouflage animals such as chameleons can change their color to match their surroundings this phenomenon is called camouflage this helps the animal to hide or escape from enemies next is thick skin many desert animals such as camels have thick skin to avoid loss of water through sweating children today we are going to learn about adaptations for breathing breathing is the process of moving air into and out of the lungs to facilitate gaseous exchange different type of animals have different organs for breathing they are lungs gills skin and spiracles let's see each one in detail lungs are a pair of spongy air filled organs located on either side of the chest human beings and sheep breathe through their nose from the nose air is carried to special organ called lungs gills are the respiratory organ found in many aquatic organisms fish breathe with the help of gills like fish tadpole prawn and crab also breathe through their gills earthworms breathe through their moist skin some animals have more than one breathing organ for example frogs breathe through moist skin when they are in water and breathe through their lungs when they are on land insects such as grasshoppers and cockroaches breathe through tiny holes present along the sides of their body these tiny holes are called spiracles children look at the spiracles these are the tiny holes through which the insects breathe let's do a quick recap on organs for breathing in animals different type of animals have different organs for breathing human beings and animals like sheep breathe through their nose from nose air is carried to the lungs fish breathe with the help of gills earthworms breathe through their moist skin frogs have more than one breathing organ they breathe through their moist skin when they are in water and also breathe through lungs when they are on land insects such as grasshoppers and cockroaches breathe with the help of tiny holes called spiracles let's do an activity children identify the breathing organs in these animals